What's up guys, Evil Deer here. So today I want to speak to you about addiction because I have a highly addictive personality and it actually took me years to get control of my random addictions. Now it's not like smoking or drinking or anything like that and that's probably the reason I've stayed away from heavy drinking, heavy smoking all these years. In fact I've never smoked a cigarette in my entire life because I fear with my addictive type of personality I'll just hook onto it, I'd grab into it and I'd, I'd be sucked in and I'd be stuck. Now why I want to speak to you about this subject is because it was something actually my missus brought up today. I've just started playing this game which is called World of Warcraft which I played years and years and years ago and I actually played it probably for about three years straight and I got really into the game like it became it ruled my life for a point. This was before how I met her and it actually got to a point where I, I had to cut myself off just completely. I just stopped playing the game one day and I went that's it and I thought I conquered my addiction but I didn't really conquer it in one sense. I changed my addiction from one thing directly to another and it was at that point that I actually learned Esperanto and I kind of just siphoned all of my my personality to something else and I went and learned that and I got really addicted to that for a while and then I realized that again I just transferred my addiction so I cut it off and I've stepped back a bit and I had to take like a real look at myself and say look it's great that you have passion it's great that you love doing certain things but you can't let it rule your life so I really had to learn this lesson and it's one of those things I struggle with every day. I have to, like, if I'm playing a game and I get really into it, sometimes I just have to put it down for a few days and say, I know you love this, but you can't let it take control of you. And it's the same with Esperanto. Like, I will get really into the language I love promoting, I love reading things in it, but then I'll realize if I get too much into it, other things get dropped by, like um, life requirements, you know, time with the family, stuff like that. So I just have to step back. And I wanted to speak to, about this because I want to know how many of you guys also have the same problem, this addictive personality. And I want to kind of find out how many Esperantists are also like this. Are you guys, is it this something where you've just become addicted to it and you just have to speak it? Now, for me, it was like that at first. Now I speak the language for many different reasons and that whole addictive aspect is over, it's gone. However, it is interesting to find out because you'll read like, you know, on Facebook or on Reddit or on any location really, certain posts by Esperantists and, and you go look at their Facebook wall, okay, and everything is just an Esperanto. Everything's about Esperanto. And it's treated almost like a religious addictive um, passion almost like and I'm not saying it's a bad thing I'm just saying well I'm not saying anything I'm just asking is this something that we can easily get addicted to is it I don't know maybe maybe it's almost in some sense treated like what happens with cults now I'm not associating Esperanto in any shape or form with a cult but it's the same type of thing people get drawn into it and then they get hooked and I'm wondering is it because I have an addictive personality or can anyone become addicted to anything is that is it just human nature in general to be addictive to well that's probably the wrong word but just to become addicted to things so anyway that's my random spiel i'd love to hear you guys i'd love to hear about the random stuff you've been addicted to over the years like everyone well, not everyone but a lot of people get addicted to smoking and drinking but what random things have just grabbed you and held you tight for just an, an insane amount of time and then you've had to take a step back and go whoa I'm actually addicted to whatever this is so yeah let me know in the comments below if you've liked this video give it a like uh, share with your friends and if you haven't already subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next video or I'll make it my addiction to find you and do bad things <laughs>